Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today what I have for you guys is a brand new GTA 5 online video and in today's video we're not actually going to be talking about the weekly update news that's going to be coming tomorrow when we get the early weekly event information early. I make those videos on Wednesday today. This is just a reminder of all of the past week's incentives, bonuses, discounts, free rewards, different removed vehicles that have been featured back into the game for a limited time, same with the rare vehicles, and some really good military themed vehicle discounts. If you're new to the game and you just kind of wanted to jump in into the community right away and involve yourself with everything that's going on right now in GTA Online and everything currently, or if you haven't been playing over the past week and you want to take advantage before we switch over to the next weekly event, well then this video will be perfect for you. So with that being said, thank you so much for tuning in, and let's get started with today's video. Our bonuses for this week are really not impressive at all, but they could be helpful if you don't have any businesses in the game and you want to make some extra money using a weekly event money bonus well here are some options we have double money and double rp on the drift races for this week we also have double money and double rp on the motor wars adversary mode this week which could be kind of fun if you can find some players to play with here and then on next gen the wildlife photography challenge is also double money and rp and that's actually a pretty decent one for how easy it is but of course you know there's no business bonuses which i think a lot of players have really wanted in gta for the past couple months here in Rockstar just hasn't really been giving out those types of weeks. When it comes to our discounts as well as our removed vehicles, which we'll get into a little bit later, but the discounts are pretty good as well. There are a bunch of military themed discounts. So first, I'm not on PlayStation 5 or Xbox Series X and S to discuss this one necessarily. I can't showcase it to you on the in-game website, but we do have 30% off the Pegasi weaponized Ignis on sale for $3,150,000. It's 30% off. This is just the standard one that's not on discount, but the weaponized one, which I review in my buyer's guide for the discounts is pretty good. After that, we also have 40% off the B11 Strike Force that's on sale for $2,280,000. It is an incredible jet to be flying around here in this game. We have the HVY Chernabog that is on sale here as well for 40% off, and it's on sale for $900,000. The HVY APC is also going to be 40% off, and it's on sale for $1,855,350 or even lower with the trade price. The Insane Surgeant Pickup is also going to be 40% off. That's on sale here. You can get it for $810,000. And then you can also actually upgrade it to the Insurgent Pickup Custom. And you can get it as a personal vehicle then for $202,500 on top of the $810,000 here as well. The Mammoth Patriot Mill Spec is also going to be on discount here for 30% off on sale for $897,750. It is a Monty Tech capable and it's pretty good. And then we also have the newer Salvage Yards that released as part of the Chop Shop. These are 25% off, so you can get them for as low as $1,215,000 this week, but it's this really poor location up here. Wouldn't really recommend that one. I would recommend either as the second best being La Puerta, but it's kind of annoying to get to. The best, in my opinion, is going to be Strawberry. At the Diamond Casino and Resort, our podium vehicle for this week is the HVY Night Shark, which is an incredible vehicle to be using here in GTA Online, especially if you're a solo player and is looking just for something armored and bulletproof just to drive around the map with whether you play in public lobbies or mostly like me and you're in invite only sessions the hvy night shark is such a treat and i already have one but we're gonna try and win another today might as well this is one of the last few days of the week that you can spin the wheel and try and unlock it i wish the best of luck to everyone let me know in the comments if you guys received yours i must say though i am a fan of the night shark last year in my top 10 vehicles that you want to own in 2023 video i said the night shark was definitely on that list and are we gonna actually, oh my god, no way did we just pull it? I haven't won a podium vehicle in a video here in a couple months. Wow, okay, I don't know which garage to put in actually. I may put in my agency, yeah, I'll put in my agency for now. I think I have some space there. That's incredible, let's go! At the LS Car Meet, your LS Car Meet prize ride for this week is the Vapid Winky. So if you do wanna unlock it, we do have the prize ride challenge, which is place top three in LS Car Meet series races for two days in a row, not a big, or time intensive requirement at all, but this vehicle is honestly just like a piece of garbage. But unless you wanna unlock it, you can go for it. But after that, we have three amazing removed vehicles also here as our test drive vehicles for this week at the LS Car Meet. If you guys are on PlayStation 5, 
Survivor Xbox Series X and S, the Pegasi Weaponized Ignis is going to be your premium test drive vehicle, but when it comes to our standard test drive vehicles here for PC, PlayStation 4, as well as Xbox One, we have the Grati Cheetah, which is for sale here for $650,000. It's a removed vehicle. After that, we have the Benefactor Shafter LWB, or Long Wheelbase, for $208,000. And then we also have this Anis SADRR that's for sale for $2,575,000. As with all of the removed vehicles, I review these in my removed vehicles video each week, and so I will have that link down in the description below so you guys can get the performance stats of these vehicles, plus the ones we'll be checking out next at Premium Deluxe Motorsport. Next up, like I said, is Simeon's dealership, aka Premium Deluxe Motorsport, and jumping in, we have five more removed vehicles. So we will start off with probably the best one here, the Benefactor Sterling GT that's for sale here for $975,000. After that, you can find that Canis Seminole Frontier for sale for $600,000 and $78,000. These are two excellent pickups. I recommend both. You'll get more details from that removed and rare vehicles video if you check that out in the description. We also have the Western Cliffhanger, which you can find for $225,000. After that, we have the Hijack Rustin for $430,000. And then we wrap up with the Western Rat Bike for only $48,000, but the cliffhanger, even though it's more money, it is just a better overall bike. Here at Luxury Autos, you will find the following two vehicles. Neither are removed. You can get them on in-game websites, and they're both new with the Chop Shop update, so they're not that impressive. We have the Fathom FR36, but it does come applied with the nice livery that you could see right here. And then we also have that newer Cavalcade XL that just released a couple months ago as a drip feed DLC vehicle as part of the Chop Shop update with this nice, like, lined, stripey, geometric pattern livery. So that's pretty nice right there. Don't forget about our three salvage yard vehicles this week here in GTA Online that you could take advantage of. Unfortunately, none are claimable. This was just like a small glitch that happened. It would showcase that the Dubachi Wagner was claimable if you were here when the tunables changed and you were logged into the game. Otherwise, if you logged on after, you wouldn't actually see that little garage symbol claimable icon. But nonetheless, these are the claimable vehicles. The Dubachi Wagner, the Drufati Z-Type, as well as the Willard Dudora. They are part of the McTony robbery, the cargo ship robbery, and then the gang banger robbery here, respectively. At the gun van, we will check out this week's offerings. So starting off in the weapons category, we do have the baseball bat. We have the tactical SMG the Unholy Hellbringer, the Precision Rifle, the Pump Action Shotgun, the Night Stick, as well as the Assault Rifle. Now, when it comes to your two discounts with the Gun Van, the Pump Action Shotgun is gonna be 30% off for all players. And then if you're looking to pick up that Precision Rifle, even though it's not that good, GTA Plus members can also take a 30% off discount on this weapon. So if you need it and you're paying for that subscription, well then you might as well pick it up because this is just a great discount just to take advantage of. Even if it's not that great of a weapon, you might as well take advantage of it. Our time trials that you have a limited time left to take advantage of is up and at them with a part time of one minute and 41 seconds for our normal time trial. Our HSW time trial is Textile City to Stab City. And then our premium race for this week, if you'd like to take advantage, it is eight figure bonus and it is locked to the sports classics class here in this game. So with that all being said, we're gonna be wrapping things up right here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Honestly, again, the money bonuses is not that great for this week like we talked about at the very beginning, but when it comes to some of the removed vehicles that are features back for a limited time this week, like this awesome Canis Seminole Frontier Off-Roader here in this game that I got a lot of comments about in that removed vehicles video. People were saying that they like the customization options on it, stuff like that. It's a great vehicle to drive in this game. We also have some good military-themed vehicle discounts here this week, and of course, that was a joy to make in my discounts buyer's guide, but overall, those were the two kind of features of this weekly update that carried this week. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys have a fantastic day here. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Drop a like if you guys did go on to enjoy or if you just found the video helpful. Check me out over on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. I actually live stream GTA Online as well as Red Dead Online several times a week here on that channel. And of course, all my other social medias you can keep up to date with, with me here as well. So again, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you all have a fantastic day. And I will see you guys in the next GTA Online video with the weekly update news going live tomorrow. Adios, amigos.